All right, so we have the whole combo in our hands. We have the whole wide combo in our hands. Okay, play land and then another odd creature. Thank you. Thank you, opponent. I appreciate you playing into my extinction event 100%. You are the greatest opponent that ever opponented. I appreciate everything you've done for me and uh, my community. Thank you for adding to the content. My fair citizens, Sodium City, we have Exploring Liliana. Now, this deck basically revolves around Liliana land destruction. Now, you may ask, that is not consistent, it's not stable, but you're wrong, it is stable, it is consistent, so shut up. Um, you'll see it quite a few times, or you'll see opponents surrender before it can actually happen. Either way, it is very, very good. Um, so you'll see it, you'll see it, it's amazing. So Liliana Dreadhorde General, six mana Planeswalker, uh, it's kind of expensive, but whenever a creature you control dies, draw a card. We don't really have any creatures outside of Liliana's um, creatures that she makes with her plus one. Um, so create a two, two black zombie creature token. Uh, and then we are also running uh, Karn, um, not the naked Karn, but the loincloth Karn, uh, which is very good. I do still really like this Karn. I want to start running him more and more in decks. Um, I forget how much I love this Karn. So it's ba it basically makes up for the lack of a lot of card draw that's in here. We are running Maze Mind Tome, which helps, um, but this Karn just helps so much. Um, it helps like almost guarantee your land drops. It does so much i really really like this karn and i want to use them in a lot more decks so basically the plus one revealed top two cards of your library an opponent chooses one of them put that card into your hand exile the other one with the silver counter on it so that's cool minus one and it comes in it's basically a six pack so you put it into play plus one it's four mana has six loyalty it's hard to deal with that early on in the game then minus one put a card you own with the silver counter on it from exile into your hand so if you get two cards one of them is a land and the other one is a card you really wanted usually almost always they will give you a land and then the next turn you can minus one the Karn to get the card you really wanted back in your hand or if it's just like two lands it's kind of whatever you didn't want them anyway so that's great you get one guaranteed in your hand one in exile that you don't care about and then again you can plus one to do the same thing next turn um, but then you also have the minus two, which is create a zero zero colorless construct. We call it a construct. Artifact creature token with this creature gets plus one plus one for each artifact you control. Now, the only other artifact that we're running outside of those uh, constructs are Maze Mind Tomes. And obviously, Maze Mind Tomes do exile themselves after you use them, but Maze Mind Tomes are still an artifact. But usually, we'll only do the minus two to create a creature. Uh, when either we're going to uh, require a blocker, like if we're going up against an aggro deck and we just need a blocker, uh, or if we need to draw cards with Liliana. So a lot of times we can put down a Karn, do a minus two, um, and then uh, do a minus four with Liliana to draw a card. Um, obviously doing a plus one with Karn is usually way more beneficial, but you know, uh, if we scribe with a Maze Mind Tome and we know what's on top and we really want that card, opponents, there's no way opponent's going to give it to us. You know, we can minus two with Karn, minus four to get the card guaranteed. So it's just like little things um, that you can do. But what we ended up doing is we started off with Ashiok Dream Render in there. So we had Ashiok, which was the little baby Ashiok, as spells and abilities your opponent's control can't cause their controller to search their library. Now this being in the deck is very, very powerful because it's a very good Planeswalker. Um, you can also minus one to mill the opponent's graveyard. We'll never do this to ourselves, but we'll target them and then we get to exile their graveyard. There's a lot of decks that are using their graveyard to actually do things, whether it's um, the Dreadhorde Arcanist, Uro, whatever else it may be. Um, so it's just good in general 
Um, but we decided that we didn't really need it. Um, we do, it's hard to say because we do miss it. We do get destroyed by a lot of decks that utilize their graveyard um, heavily. Uh, but I believe taking out three of these Ashioks and adding in three of the Loincloth Karns is really just better overall. Um, it ended up being more consistent, so we like that anyway. So um, the way that we're able to ultimate Lily is simply by either plussing her a bunch, which almost never happens, but we can plus her. If she stays alive for one turn, we use plain wide celebration to essentially just proliferate four times. So if we get a plus one, get a blocker for Liliana, which is great. We can minus two for Karn, get another blocker. And then, you know, if we block both of those, they both die because they're weak creatures. We draw two cards and then hopefully next turn, we get to proliferate four times with plain wide celebration and then ultimate Lily. Now what this does is that each opponent chooses a permanent type they control of each permanent and then sacrifice the rest. So this means they can have one land, one enchantment, one artifact, one planeswalker, and one creature. This is fantastic because we are running Golgari colors. So of course we are running Casualties of War, which literally destroys one of each permanent type. So they go down to one of every permanent type, and then we can destroy one of every permanent type, usually the next turn, because obviously we're not going to have, you know, 13 mana or a ton of mana. A lot of times we will, but sometimes we have to do other things like a board wipe of, you know, Extinction Event or a Languish or something like that. Um, either way, uh, this was a very good deck. I really do like the Lilion Ultimate. Um, this was kind of a play off of a deck that we did the other day. Um, although that one was running blue with Tamiyo, which I actually would rather entertain this deck with Tamiyo a little bit more and maybe add uh, this Ashiok back in and do almost more of a Super Friends type of deck and then add Elder Spell in here um, and then possibly throw back in Uro uh, would also be a possibility. So it, it's one of those things to where there's a lot of potential in here and just, you know what else has great synergy? You and me, this YouTube channel. So hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification. You get notified every single time that we come out with a video seven days a week. Simply having the Lilion Ultimate just demolishes people's hopes and dreams of winning. So enjoy, enjoy. This one is very, very good. And as for yesterday's comment question of the day, I asked you, what cards do you want to be in the next Historic Anthologies pack coming out in January? Here are your answers. If you want your comment featured in these videos, make sure that you answer the comment question of the day in every single video seven days a week. Don't forget to follow me over at twitch.tv slash striderstone. I stream over there five days a week every day except Monday and Thursday. Schedule is down below. Stay salty and enjoy the games. Yeah, it would help us get our Liliana, but it wouldn't help us get our Plain Wide Celebration or any of our board wipes or anything else. It would really only help us get our Ashiok, our Wolf Willow Haven, and a Lily, which I guess isn't the worst thing, obviously. So those are all great cards. But... Okay, so we can Wolf Willow Haven into a Cultivate, and then we can Casualties of War if we're not dead. We can play in wide celebration.
Alright. Let's see if he kills me. Let's see if he kills me. Alright. Oh. Just go ahead and do that. <laughs> You're like, Raptor. Like, okay, which Raptor? Which Raptor? Even. Alright, we did it. Okay. Did the things. Wasn't bad. Wasn't great, but wasn't bad. Somebody made me open up the vault yesterday, so now I have no idea how much percentage our vault is at. Last time I checked, I think it was at 46-ish percent, so I don't think we're going to get there until the next set comes out. TG assistant can show you. Yeah, there's a way you can see it in the logs as well. Two, three, four, five. So we can haven into a languish. Pretty simple, but a little... Yeah, I don't know what to look for. I'm sure there's a keyword to look for, which would be easy. That's odd. Yeah. Okay. So we can cultivate again, and then Bala to bring back a cultivate? Or bother to bring back. Let's bother to bring back our languish. If you press Alt F four, it shows you your vault progress. Awesome. I'll make sure to do that. Yeah, get rid of their mana source. No more second Vivian for you. It sucks because I like I almost want to take out the Ashiox to put in tomes or something to gain like just to draw cards and shit, you know? Notifications must not be working. Redeem shave beard, uh-huh, sure, sure. Sure you did. Alright, we'll just use what they know we have. Or, we'll use what they know that we have. It's true, I saw it. I don't have it in my requests. It's not happening. Oh no, chat, we got you baited. How would we have never saw that coming? 
Thanks. Now I have a 2-2. Two -two. See, I have a witness. I don't believe you. Maybe I should even that? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Well, I mean, now I get more value out of it. Now I get even more value out of it. How long have you been growing the beard? Close to three years now. I am still drawing lands. Yeah, we definitely need card draw in here. Very long beard for that long? Yeah. Alright. We're on that meal plan. We on that meal plan. Okay. Cultivate. Is that our fourth cultivate? It is. All right, we still have our four Lilianas, our three plain wide celebrations, three casualties of war. Yeah. Dude. We had so many cards. We had so many cards. We had like a 25% chance to win that game. That's what happens when you have no card draw. So, let's fix this. What is Magic Mirror? Well, for each instant sorcery card that's in your graveyard, you have no maximum hand size being of your upkeep. If you have a knowledge counter on Magic Mirror, then draw a card. Name your upkeep for the knowledge counter. I don't know how well that would really work with this. Yeah, yeah, I know, Maze Mind Tom. I think you want a blue, blue, blue. Well, yeah, obviously. It's like, I want Ashiok. Ashiok is really good. I think we have to take out that. Add in that. Is it joke? Nah. Seems legit to me, man. That's cool. So we can mace my tome and draw a card. Boom. Nobody thinks not in this deck, no, but remind me after this to do a quick thing, like a Simic deck. Even then, I think I would have to put in some type of board. Maybe.
Uh, if I can get a land. I'm like, come on, please. Okay. So now we just Liliana into a plain white celebration. What is that? Svimix! What's going on, man? How you doing? Thank you for the raid. I know you didn't too. All that great on day two. No, how could you? Son of a how dare you? How could you? <laughs> how could you? I am exhausted. I was so excited. I was gonna ult Lily, and all of a sudden, two two. Yeah, that sucks. Well, you made it to day two. A lot of people didn't make it to day two. If it makes you feel better. But yeah, have a great night. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I appreciate the raid. Shout outs. Shout outs. A, a big One Piece fan, and that's what matters. All right. Don't do it again. They did it again, chat. Chat, they did it again! One Piece is trash? Dude, One Piece is great. What are you talking about? Shut the like fuck up! What up, smoke pipe? You did 6 2 today on day 2? God damn. Grats, smoke pipe. Jesus. What deck were you playing? Qualified for Kaldeheim? Wait, what's. What is the qualification thing? Language works on enchantments? Oh shit, I didn't know that. Alright, let me do that next turn. All right, so we do this, we attack, and then we languish, right? Hi. <laughs> Jesus. I'm trying to play shrines. I mean, they're doing it successfully. We need another casualties of war. All right, that works. That one and that one. I don't like it. Yes. Give me my other Liliana. <laughs> so
So she is a fresh Liliana. <laughs> I want so big, so fresh. Either that or sacrifice all of your shrines. One of the two. No. Got it. I seem to have laid waste to your army. Oops. You have laid waste to my army. Or I have laid waste to your army. Our Ashiok is our Ashiok's a big thing. All right, you are going to get milled out eventually. I have, I can do 40 cards. You have 25 left. I got it. We did it. We beat shrines. Oh boy. Easy. Easiest deck or easiest deck ever. Lean into proliferate. I don't need to lean. All we need is plain white celebration. All we need. Yeah, I'm thinking Bant as well. This is quite a bit of ramp. Yeah, I've never done a magic mirror deck. Or Sultai. Yeah, because I think we definitely need removal. So Sultai or Bant are the only two real options. Ew. Ew. I think I cultivate anyway, just so I can get closer to my Liliana. And it thins out the deck, try to get a board wipe. So we need a board wipe as soon as possible. This is gonna be a problem. All right, we got a board wipe. Easy game. Never didn't have it. Never didn't have it. And then we got a little bit of life gain. Now we get Liliana next turn. So if they play two creatures, make them sack that shit. Um, that's fine. Let's give them a land, shall we? Twelve head. Does it have to? No, it's whenever it attacks. Not sure if they open swing into that. Maybe they do. Okay. Awesome. That's like a super cool card. Hmm. I really want them to get back whatever it is that they could potentially get back. Awesome. Plain wide celebration off the top. Did not get a plain wide celebration off the top. Oh. I see.
I'm not attacking here. Because if they have some way to draw a card and then put down two hasties. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Yeah. And I'm just gonna ball out and get it back. Maybe I should have just ulted and then balled, get it back, and played it. Is that the last draw? Was that the last straw? I think we could have stopped them from drawing two cards earlier, but that's pretty much it. Alright. Extinction event is a beautiful draw. Liliana is a beautiful draw. This is what we like to see. This is what we like to see. We can get double green from this since we don't have any other ones. Stop it. Could you stop? Could you not though? I said stop! Alright, so we have the whole combo in our hands. We have the whole wide combo in our hands. Okay, play land and then another odd creature. Thank you. Thank you, opponent. I appreciate you playing into my extinction event 100%. You are the greatest opponent that ever opponented. I appreciate everything you've done for me and uh, my community. Thank you for adding to the content. All right, if we get a land, we get to Lily ult. Right? Land destruction. Land destruction. And then we have a casualties of war next turn to just kind of finish it off, you know? Just to finish off the creature and land. That feels like a surrender. It is not. It, <laughs> it is truly a tragedy. Minus four lands. Definitely minus four lands. Wait, why do they still have 40-something cards? I feel... This looks like a fun new toy. <laughs> what up, Dig Dug? No.
You surrender to explore. Not the lily ult, I see. I see. I see. That's what happens when you forget guys. Fine, I'll add in one guy's blessing. Jesus, fuck. Boom. Instead of Ashiok, we can run Karn with the board. Not the worst idea. Um, artifacts. Let's see, what artifacts do we want? Noxious Gear Hulk, obviously. I kind of want the other Karn, to be honest, for the card draw. Just saying. Should have both of them in here. Mm, don't really need to. Yeah, it does. It helps a lot from our card draw. Um, yeah. No, chat. What are we gonna do against a mill deck? This is gonna be hard. Just, <laughs> did you <laughs> did you ask the blessing? I did. I asked the blessing so hard. I probably should have shocked that in so I could draw a card with that. <laughs> Sucks that now we took out It does suck that now we took out the, um... Oh, they had both of them, okay. I see. Um... Hmm... I think we do this. We can guarantee our six. Get to draw a card after this as well. All right. So 
We can Lily on a down tick. Ugh. I think that's the only thing we could do right now. They might lure us. Okay. Yeah. Make me discard a bunch of cards, right? Okay. So do they... They have to kill the Lily, right? So they're gonna play that and then play the thingamabob. The other... Blackguard. Right? This was unpleasant. Hmm. Um, I think I'm gonna casualties and just kill that swamp. Yeah, it's gotta be a counter spell, right? The uh, didn't say please or whatever. Drown and lock, yeah, that one too. All right, no counter. Fuck. The undead make great really didn't want them to put down another creature. That was like the one thing. They can kill my lily, but I can bring back the Karn and the lily. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, three. So if we top deck a land, I can plain white celebration, bring back a Karn, a lily, make a couple creatures or heal, right? Death near. Time to go. Obviously, unless they have. Why is ladder so unfun? I don't know. I don't have a bad time with ladder. I am Karen. I am Karen. Maybe it's your cool decks making your opponents look bad. Hey, we like both of those. Obviously, another counter spell. Oh, maybe they were looking for one. Um, I get to minus one and get back my languish, which is exactly what we want. Okay, no longer. Okay, I do still get to do that. 
but it doesn't kill it. No! Two, three, four. Hmm. Oh, okay. All right. I could have sworn he was going to have a counter for that. Return. Only face goblins, blue white control, and auras and diamond at the moment. That sucks. I have gone up against a couple mono red decks. Mm hmm. Um, let's do this. You may regret that choice. Yeah, give me that lily. <laughs> um... Lawfully Denial. I didn't know they ran Lawfully Denials, chat. It was my fault. I wouldn't have ran into that. I thought they were just running Didn't Say Please and Drowned in Lock. I thought they were only running those two. Lawfully Denial's four, not three, right? Did I just run into another one? Fuck, it is four. Oh, I was Drowned in Lock anyway. Okay. Did you play the Qualifier today? I did not. I did not. I do not play best of three. I pretty much just meme out in best of one. Oh, it's one without flyers. Okay. thing that's gonna suck is that if Karn ends up getting a Gaia's Blessing, we're kind of fucked. So we only have one Gaia's Blessing. And we only have one more Baligat. Hey. Nice. Odd, odd, odd. Nice. <laughs> Should pick odd? I am. 
And then I'm going to pick even. Thank you for refilling everything. <laughs> So Grixis School, when are you going to do the five mana bolus with plain wide celebration? When's that happening? Not ever? Why not? Sounds amazing. You don't have any plane wides? You only need like three. I'm ramping like a bitch. Let's go. You don't, unfortunately? How? It's from like... What is this from? I don't even know what's it. Is this War of the Spark? Liliana, we like those. Although... It's not gonna help because they're gonna have way more than two creatures all right if i could get one of my board wipes that would be exquisite exquisite i know elves i'll keep scry i suppose i could just in case See, it was a waste. I could have just drawn. Yep, that's odd. Please only find one creature. One creature? Damn. All right, so we're gonna do this. Let us march into battle and make new for a good, mindless minion. We're gonna get a blocker. Woo! That's not good. Do they kill my lily? Do they kill my lily? We'll draw a card first. Let's see what we get out of this. Not respecting Crater Huff? We do. Still want to draw a card from this. Hog. Choices we make reveal who we are. But I make a lot of bad choices. Does that mean I'm a bad choice? <laughs> uh... 
Um, turn. Well chosen indeed. Yeah, give me land. Land would be great. Um, let's get that, that, and that. Three, four, six, seven, eight, ten. We need twelve mana to do what we want to do. Mm, we should have put down Lily first. Should have put down Lily first. Senna could have drawn two cards. The punt. The punt is real. Rise and shine. What was lost is now returned. Just in case. Cardboard Live isn't working? You were going down to one land. Um... Oh. It... <laughs> It forced an update in the middle of the stream. So that's nice. All right, so that's why it's not working. Okay. Give it a minute to update. Karn minus 14 soon. Yeah. Well, we have a Casualties of War for their last shit, right? Okay, cool. Yeah, you can go away now. Yep. All right, thank you. Thank you for going away now. Thank you for going away now. Plain White Celebration is the shit. Opponent with zero permanence. I know, it's the great. It's a good feeling. GG's. GG's. Yo, what up, YouTube? Yeah, we going here, Strider. Come on. You didn't really think that I was that type of person, did you? Thank you, everyone, so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you were even a little bit entertained by this video, please make sure to let me know down below. And if you have anything that you would like to see next, go ahead and leave that there, too. And make sure to check out my live stream five days a week, every day except Sunday and Thursday. Stream time's down below.